Okay, this tutorial show you how to install Apache NetBeans 11.0. So let me go to uh, NetBeans Apache website. Click download. You may download um, binary format. I may select the first one. Installation is same as uh, my previous NetBeans 10. So just unzip it. I may put in the C drive program files because I'm using 64 bits Windows 10. It may take about 10 to 15 minutes to unzip it. Depends on your, your uh, PC. Okay, look for NetBeans. Then etc. And uh, let's set up uh, configurations. So basically saying um, point to JDK installation directory. So um, as you can see, I have a JDK 1.8 also. JDK 11. So I'm going to use uh, JDK 11. This is actually open JDK 11. If you want to download Oracle JDK um, 11, you may download new version 11.0.3. Okay, basically say I need to open it as administration mode. So just say yes, I will um, reopen it. So let me uncomment and then copy paste um, server installation directory. Save it, close it. Uh, yes, save it. Close it. Okay, now let me go back to NetBeans installation directory and uh, let me go to bins folder. So I'm using 64 bits, so I will launch that bin 64. Okay, as you can see, I'm using uh, Java 11.0.2, which is OpenJDK version, rather than Oracle version. Okay, editor is, um, actually let me just quickly check, uh, font and color, I prefer to use a bigger size, 16 font size. Comments I prefer to use a magenta rather than gray. So Java, um, if you're using um, JavaFX, you may uh, report to SimBuilder. Which is um, in, I already installed Sim Builder 11, so program file Sim Builder 11. Apply OK. And the last one, output window. I like to have a bigger font size as well, so it's already changed to 16. Apply OK. Let me create one um, project. Okay, this one basically say there's update. So Just install. Okay, let's create new project. Uh, 
again I will just say hello world. You type S out and then tap key. And then it's going to give you system out print errand. Okay, there is one source file. Let me just run the project. See, as you can see, there is a hello world on upper window. Okay, you may like to have a shortcut on desktop. So I just use the Netpin64. Then uh, you may need a bit. Netpin's IDE. 11.0 That's all Thank you